Welcome back to our channel. We hope you'll find valuable content here. If you enjoy our channel, please remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more. Let's dive in. India, often referred to as the jewel in the crown of Asia, has seen remarkable growth over the past two decades. Imagine a country that was once primarily known for its spices and textiles, now standing shoulder to shoulder with global economic giants. It's like watching a local cricket player rise through the ranks to become an international star. Introduction to the Indian Economy India, a vast and diverse nation, is often likened to a tapestry woven with multiple cultures, languages, and traditions. But beyond its rich cultural heritage, India has another story to tell, that of its economic journey. Imagine a bustling marketplace in a small town. There are vendors selling spices, artisans showcasing their crafts, and farmers bringing in their fresh produce. This marketplace is vibrant, full of potential, and represents the essence of commerce. Now, picture this marketplace expanding, modernizing, and evolving over time. That's the story of the Indian economy. Two decades ago, India was primarily recognized for its agricultural contributions and traditional industries. The image that often came to mind was that of farmers tilling the land, or artisans weaving beautiful textiles. But as the years rolled on, this image began to shift. The small marketplace started to grow, with new shops, modern goods, and innovative services. This transformation didn't happen overnight. It was the result of various factors, decisions, and events that shaped India's economic landscape. Today, India isn't just a country of spices and textiles. It's a nation that's making its mark in the fields of technology, manufacturing, and services. It's a country that's attracting global investors, producing world-class entrepreneurs, and showcasing its potential on the world stage. But how did this transformation occur? What were the milestones in India's economic journey? And what challenges did the country face along the way? To understand this, we need to delve deeper into India's economic history, its moments of crisis, its decisions for reform, and its vision for the future. India's Rise on the Global Stage The story of India's economic ascent is akin to an underdog sports team that, against all odds, rises to challenge the champions. It's a tale of resilience, innovation, and sheer determination. In the grand arena of the world economy, countries compete, collaborate, and constantly evolve. Over the past two decades, India has been a standout performer in this global game. From a position of relative obscurity, India has sprinted ahead, overtaking many of its peers to claim its spot as the fifth largest economy in the world. Imagine a marathon where runners represent countries. Some runners have been leading for a long time, setting the pace and direction. These are the established economic giants. Then, there's a runner who started somewhere in the middle but has been steadily gaining ground, overtaking one competitor after another. This runner is India. The factors propelling India's rise are multifaceted. The country's vast and youthful population provides both a massive consumer base and a dynamic workforce. The entrepreneurial spirit runs deep, leading to the birth of innovative startups and global companies. Moreover, India's strategic position in global trade routes and its rich natural resources have made it a focal point for international investments. But it's not just about numbers and rankings. India's rise is also reflected in its growing influence in international forums, its ability to attract global events and conferences, and its expanding cultural footprint, from Bollywood to yoga. Yet, as with any journey, there have been challenges. While India has surpassed countries like Korea, Canada, and even the UK, it still has mountains to climb. Predictions suggest that India might soon surpass economic powerhouses like Japan and Germany, but the path is fraught with both opportunities and obstacles. Tech Giants and Apple's Move In the world of business, there's a saying, follow the money. And when global tech giants start making significant moves into a country, 
it's a clear sign of that nation's growing economic prominence. Imagine a bustling tech city, somewhat like Silicon Valley. Skyscrapers with logos of major tech companies, young professionals discussing the latest innovations over coffee, and startups dreaming of becoming the next big thing. Now, transport that image to India. That's the transformation the country has been undergoing. One of the most notable endorsements of India's tech prowess and economic potential came when Apple, the tech behemoth, decided to shift a significant portion of its iPhone production to India. It's akin to a world-renowned chef choosing to open a restaurant in a new city, signaling the city's rising culinary status. But why India? The answer lies in a combination of factors. Cost-effective production, India offers a competitive advantage in terms of production costs. Think of it as shopping in a market where high-quality ingredients are available at a more affordable price. Skilled workforce, India has a vast pool of talented engineers, designers, and tech professionals. It's like a talent show where many participants have exceptional skills, ready to contribute to the tech world. Huge consumer market, with its massive population, India is a lucrative market for tech products. Imagine a concert where the audience numbers are in the billions, eagerly waiting for the next big hit. Government incentives, the Indian government has been rolling out the red carpet for foreign investors with various incentives and schemes. It's like a city offering tax breaks and benefits to attract businesses. However, Apple's move is just the tip of the iceberg. Numerous tech unicorns, startups valued at over $1 billion, have sprouted in India, spanning sectors from e-commerce and fintech to edtech and health tech. These unicorns are not just serving the domestic market but are also making their presence felt globally. The Shadows of Poverty and Corruption Every bright city skyline has its shadows, and in the story of India's economic rise, there are areas that remain in the dark. While the nation has made significant strides in various sectors, challenges like poverty and corruption persist, casting a shadow over its achievements. Imagine a beautiful garden, lush and green, with flowers blooming in every corner. But as you walk through it, you occasionally come across patches where the grass is withered and the plants struggle to grow. These patches represent the challenges that India faces, even as it blossoms in many other areas. Poverty, India's vast population is a double-edged sword. On one hand, it provides a massive consumer base and workforce. On the other, ensuring that every individual has access to basic necessities becomes a monumental task. Picture a large family where the head tries to ensure that every member is fed, clothed, and educated. The sheer size makes it challenging, and some members might still go without. Corruption Corruption in India is like a stubborn weed in the garden. Despite efforts to root it out, it keeps cropping up, affecting growth and development. From bureaucratic red tape to illegal transactions, corruption is a challenge that permeates various levels of society and governance. But it's essential to understand that these challenges aren't unique to India. Many growing economies face similar issues. What sets India apart is its resilience and the continuous efforts by various stakeholders, from the government to NGOs, to address these challenges. India's journey is like a marathon, and while it has covered significant ground, there are still miles to go. The nation's true test lies in its ability to ensure that its growth is inclusive, benefiting every citizen, and in its resolve to weed out the challenges that hinder its path. A glimpse into the past, India's Economic History History is a powerful teacher, offering insights into the present and guiding the path to the future. To truly understand India's economic journey, we must travel back in time and explore its rich economic history. Imagine a grand old library, its shelves filled with ancient manuscripts, scrolls, and books. Each one tells a story of a time gone by. As we pull out a volume titled India's Economic History, we begin our journey. Before the 18th century, India was like a grand bazaar, bustling with activity. Its ports were hubs of global trade, with ships from various parts of the world docking to exchange goods. 
the country was renowned for its spices, textiles, and precious stones. It wasn't just a participant in the global economy, it was a leader, accounting for a significant chunk of the world's GDP. Imagine a marketplace where one stall, representing India, drew the most customers and had the most diverse and sought-after goods. The turning tide, but as the world entered the era of the Industrial Revolution, things began to change. European nations, with their advanced machinery and technology, started to dominate. And then came the British colonization of India. It's akin to a once thriving business being taken over by a larger corporation, its resources exploited, and its profits siphoned off. Post-independence era, after gaining independence in 1947, India stood at a crossroads. The nation had to decide its economic path. It chose a Soviet-style model, focusing on self-reliance and limiting foreign investments. Think of it as a business that, after facing external control, decides to go solo, relying on its resources and capabilities. While this approach had its merits, it also had limitations. The economy grew, but not at the pace it could have. The protective barriers, while ensuring self-reliance, also limited India's participation in the global economic race. Economic Reforms, the 1991 Turning Point Every great story has its turning points, moments that define the trajectory of its narrative. For India's economic tale, 1991 was such a moment. A year of crisis, introspection, and ultimately, transformation. Imagine a ship sailing on calm seas, but suddenly, a storm approaches. The ship is battered by waves, and there's a real danger of it sinking. But the crew, realizing the gravity of the situation, takes swift action, changing course and navigating through the storm to safer waters. This is analogous to India's economic situation in 1991. The crisis, India was on the brink of an economic collapse. Its foreign exchange reserves were dwindling, and there was a looming threat of defaulting on international loans. It's like a business running out of funds and facing the risk of bankruptcy. The response, in this dire situation, India turned to the International Monetary Fund, IMF, for a bailout. But this assistance came with conditions. The IMF wanted India to liberalize its economy, open up to foreign investments, and reduce trade barriers. Think of it as a business investor who agrees to bail out a struggling company but asks for significant changes in its operations. The reforms, India embarked on a journey of major economic reforms. The License Raj, a system where businesses needed government approval for most decisions, was dismantled. Foreign companies were invited to invest, and sectors that were previously closed were now open to competition. It was like a market that was once restricted, suddenly opening its gates to vendors from all over. Outsourcing boom, one of the most significant outcomes of these reforms was India's emergence as a global hub for outsourcing. With its skilled workforce and cost advantages, India became the go-to destination for companies worldwide looking to outsource their operations, especially in the IT sector. Imagine a craftsman in a village who suddenly finds himself receiving orders from all over the world because of his unique skills and affordability. These reforms weren't just about policies and numbers. They changed the very fabric of the Indian economy, setting it on a path of accelerated growth and global integration. Land, Jobs, and the Bureaucratic Maze While India's economic story has many highlights, it's also punctuated with challenges that the nation grapples with even today. Among these challenges are land scarcity, job creation, and the intricate web of bureaucracy. Imagine a vast landscape, filled with fertile fields, bustling towns, and vibrant cities. But as you zoom in, you notice patches of barren land, queues of people waiting for work, and a maze-like structure representing the bureaucratic system. This landscape is a microcosm of India's economic challenges. Land scarcity, India, with its diverse geography, has a mix of fertile plains, dense forests, and arid regions. While there's ample land, the challenge lies in its utilization. With a growing population and urbanization, 
the demand for land for housing, agriculture, and industries is ever-increasing. It's like a family that keeps growing but lives in the same house, leading to space constraints. Job creation, a young and dynamic population is one of India's strengths. But this demographic dividend also poses a challenge, creating enough jobs for the youth. With advancements in technology and automation, traditional jobs are evolving, and new opportunities are emerging. It's akin to a village fair where there are many performers, but limited stages to showcase their talent. Bureaucracy, the bureaucratic system in India is often likened to a maze. While it has its roots in ensuring governance and order, it has also become synonymous with red tape and delays. For businesses, navigating this system can be daunting. Imagine a trader wanting to set up a stall in the market but having to get multiple permissions, each from a different authority, before he can start selling. While these challenges are significant, they're not insurmountable. With reforms, innovation, and a collective will, India can turn these challenges into opportunities, paving the way for a brighter economic future. The Caste System India's caste system is a complex social structure that has evolved over thousands of years. It has played a significant role in shaping the country's social, economic, and cultural life. Understanding its origins, evolution, and contemporary implications is crucial for grasping the nuances of Indian society. Origins and Evolution The caste system originated from the ancient Varna system, a socio-religious classification that divided society into four main categories, Brahmins, priests and scholars, Kshatriyas, warriors and rulers, Vaishyas, merchants and landowners, and Shudras, laborers and service providers. Over time, this system became more intricate, giving rise to numerous subcastes or jatis, based on occupation and regional variations. Rigidity and Hierarchies The caste system's flexibility eroded over time, becoming a rigid, hereditary social order. One's caste dictated their profession, social interactions, and marital prospects. This rigidity led to a hierarchical society, with upper and lower castes. Untouchability and Discrimination The Dalits, formerly known as untouchables, occupied the lowest rung of the caste hierarchy. They were subjected to extreme discrimination and were relegated to menial, polluting tasks. This discrimination was not just social but also economic, as access to resources and opportunities was heavily influenced by one's caste. Economic Implications the caste system's economic implications were profound. Upper castes had access to education, land, and capital, while lower castes were often landless laborers confined to low-paying jobs. This led to significant economic disparities and hindered social mobility. Modern India and Reforms Post-independence India took decisive steps to dismantle the caste system's oppressive structures. The constitution abolished untouchability, prohibited caste-based discrimination, and introduced reservations in education and government jobs for scheduled castes and scheduled tribes. Laws were enacted to prevent atrocities against Dalits and promote their rights. Contemporary Challenges Despite these reforms, the caste system's legacy persists in various forms. Discrimination continues, albeit reduced, and the debate around reservations remains contentious. Addressing these challenges requires a combination of legal measures, societal change, and economic development. The caste system is a historical challenge that India continues to grapple with. Understanding its complexities is crucial for fostering a more inclusive and equitable society. The journey towards eradicating caste-based discrimination is ongoing and it requires the collective effort of individuals, communities, and the government. India's Technological Renaissance In the global landscape, India has emerged as a technological powerhouse, making significant strides in the fields of IT, software development, and digital innovation. This chapter delves into India's journey from a developing nation to a global tech hub. The IT Boom the 1990s and early 2000s saw India riding the wave of the IT boom. 
With a large pool of English-speaking engineers and professionals, India became the go-to destination for software services and IT-enabled services, ITES. Companies like Infosys, TCS, and Wipro became household names, not just in India but globally. Startup Ecosystem The last decade has witnessed the rise of a vibrant startup ecosystem in India. Cities like Bangalore, Hyderabad, and Pune have become hubs for innovation, with young entrepreneurs developing solutions for both local and global challenges. From e-commerce giants like Flipkart to ride-sharing apps like Ola, Indian startups have made their mark. Government Initiatives The Indian government has played a pivotal role in fostering this tech growth. Initiatives like Digital India aim to transform India into a digitally empowered society. The push for digital payments, especially post the demonetization move in 2016, has spurred a fintech revolution in the country. Challenges and Opportunities While the tech landscape in India is promising, it's not without challenges. Issues like data privacy, cybersecurity, and digital inequality need addressing. However, with challenges come opportunities. The need for robust cybersecurity solutions, for instance, has led to the rise of cybersecurity startups in the country. Looking ahead As India continues its tech journey, the focus is shifting towards emerging technologies like artificial intelligence, AI, machine learning, ML, and the Internet of Things, IoT. With its vast talent pool and innovative spirit, India is poised to be a leader in the global tech arena. India's Economic and Technological Odyssey India, with its rich history and diverse culture, has always been a land of contrasts. From its ancient economic prowess to its modern-day technological advancements, the country has witnessed a series of transformations that have shaped its global standing. Historical Economic Dominance Before the 18th century, India was an economic powerhouse, accounting for a significant portion of the global economy. Its decline began with the onset of the Industrial Revolution in Europe and was further exacerbated by British colonization. Post-independence economic model After gaining independence, India adopted a Soviet-style economic model, focusing on self-reliance and limiting outside investments. However, the 1991 economic crisis prompted a shift towards liberalization, opening the doors to foreign investments and making India a global hub for outsourcing. Challenges and Reforms Despite its growth, India grappled with challenges like land scarcity, job creation, and bureaucracy. The caste system, a traditional social hierarchy, added another layer of complexity to the nation's development. However, with reforms, innovation, and a collective will, India has been working towards turning these challenges into opportunities. Technological Renaissance The dawn of the 21st century saw India emerging as a technological powerhouse. The IT boom, coupled with a vibrant startup ecosystem, positioned India as a global tech hub. Government initiatives further propelled this growth, with a focus on digital empowerment and fintech solutions. India's journey, from its historical economic dominance to its current technological renaissance, is a testament to its resilience and adaptability. While challenges persist, the nation's spirit of innovation and its vast talent pool ensure that its future is bright. As India continues to evolve, it remains a key player in the global economic and technological arena, forging a path that others can learn from and be inspired by.